Visibilities are reduced across the area. We're down to half mile visibilities in Hebron and uh, part of the reason for that is wildfire smoke. You likely noticed the haze over the weekend and it's just adding more what we call condensation nuclei to the air and uh, add moisture to that and you're going to see a reduction in visibilities. <laughs> There's the hazy appearance over our Barry Law Tower Cam, but if you do look closely through the haze, there are some thunderstorms that we are watching off towards the north. Here they are on a scattered basis, so not everyone sees rain this morning, but there is a chance. We do have a severe thunderstorm warning that just came out for uh, portions of Antelope and Boone County, mostly Boone County though, Albion on the southern edge of this warning. The potential is there for up to quarter size hail. That's about it. I don't think we'll be dealing with damaging straight line winds out of that cell. We've got some new formation to in northeast Nebraska, uh, closer to Norfolk. This will all move south and east, so guess who's farther south and east? Lincoln. So there is a chance for the capital city, too. There's this cell moving through Franklin right now, maybe dropping some small hail along with it, but I don't think we'll be dealing with uh, severe winds or severe hail at this time. That storm is starting to weaken as it continues to push towards the Nebraska-Kansas state line. And then there's this activity, which is also weakening, but uh, nevertheless, uh, it is producing some rainfall, and Fairbury and Beatrice could be dealing with this before too long. So, stormcast heading through the next couple of hours. Those scattered storms will be there. This is mainly a morning issue today, and they might be borderline severe, capable of producing primarily quarter size hail. Maybe a few lingering showers into the afternoon. I'm talking one two, maybe three o'clock at the latest, and then we turn mostly clear for the remainder of the day. And then another wave of storms will approach from the west overnight tonight. That should arrive sometime tomorrow morning, and there is a severe weather potential with that. The highest chance in north central Nebraska, but you see Lincoln still included under a level one out of five risk for severe weather overnight tonight and into tomorrow morning. Right now, 64 degrees in Broken Bow, 69 in Lincoln, 64 in Norfolk, 67 in Hebron. Pretty much everybody dealing with 60s except for far northwestern portions of the state. We see 58 degrees in Chadron and 57 in Valentine. Hour by hour today, 78 degrees by 1 o'clock and then into the 80s this afternoon. We should top out near 82 degrees for a high temperature. 63 degrees tomorrow morning. I'm going a little cooler than some of the guidance because I think we'll have some rain cooled air from some morning storms tomorrow. We'll say a high of 83 degrees on Tuesday. You'll notice AM written on there. The best storm chance tomorrow will be during the morning. We should be able to find some dry time into the afternoon though. On Wednesday, we'll keep an isolated storm chance 88 degrees, maybe starting to dry out for a temporary period on Thursday.